Hey guys, so today I'm on a special server that I found out from by Yogscast Shin, or Shin from Yogscast, depending on how you want to say it. Oh, that gear's a bit tight. And he's recently done a video on a different game from the this one, the new one. And if you want me to do one, I will do one. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell you about this game because I really enjoy this game. And I want to do it. So deal with it. <laughs> I'm joking. And let's see this. Um, I'm going to be a frost mage. Um, so this are uh, these are the classes really. You get mage and you get pyromancer, cryomancer, and aquamancer. Pyro is f obviously fire, and cryo is ice, which is to slow down uh, movements really for other players. And aqua is healing. Warriors get two classes, and theirs is berserker and protection, so DPS and tank basically. And then Paladin get DPS tank and healer. And that's basically it from there. And you get quests from this quest master. And there's another one here. And from the quests, you also get these things called broken weapons. Um, I will show you what they look like on the quests. What the quest info looks like. So, like that. So, you get experience, warlord coins. The credits are just like transmog credits, and the broken weapons are just broken weapons that you can repair for better weapons. This one's the best one because you get magic dust and void shards, which are used to basically um, craft better weapons, really. And uh, that's basically it. I'm almost finished on that one. Um, and all the broken weapons go here. I just got a load of them, and I got a really good one for a warrior, but I got rid of it. Because I'm special. Right then. So, into a game. This is the game board. CTF means capture the flag. And there's a big game which has 32 players per game, so that's 16 on a team. And then there's ones with 24. And 24 is 12 per team, and that's a small one. And there's Domination, which is like a big capture the base kind of game. That's based on a rapidly simple World of Warcraft, and the other two are more some gulch. Um, time to get into a game. I'm going to play a big one, because I haven't played a big one in a while. Plus, I'm first on the realm. <laughs> well, certainly. Um, it's basically designed around Warsaw Gulch. They're all, they're all basically designed by World of Warcraft PvP. Um, I was expecting more battlegrounds than just three when I first joined, but there's only three. Um, just checking my phone. Got an email from uh, a game I backed on Kickstarter, saying that one of the, one of the uh, games is ready for me to give details for basically getting it when it comes out. Um, the good thing is about this sort of game type. Is you've got these little tip things. I'll just put through. Um, so basically, you can capture the base for 200, 200 points for scoring. Five is granted for a death when you die for the team at five points. Um, in terms of E, type of weapons, and you can play it in third person. Which for a Mac is the little FN key by the control and the shift key in the, in the bottom right hand corner, left hand corner. Yeah, left hand corner. But for everything else, it's just um, F5, which makes it that as well. And it's a basically like playing World of Warcraft. Although for a mage, it's kind of not really useful. <laughs> Because you can't really see your target if it's far away. I mean, it's worth more doing it as a warrior or a power. I haven't actually played a game in a paladin for a while, and I haven't played a game where I don't have an epic. 
so yeah that's why I'm using this because I've decided to use it because I need to get I need, basically I need to get a better weapon for it like an epic or a legendary because I haven't got a legendary for anything but I haven't got an epic for this class yet well I've got one for Pyromancer and Aquamancer but I don't use Aquamancer so I got rid of it and I've got a Void Shell a few of them um, but I don't have one for Cryomancer, uh, which is this one, it's like a frost thing, so it basically um, deals a load of frost damage and basically slows the movement, target, movement of the target, which is quite useful. Although it's not really useful when you're playing games like this. I have to admit, this is, this is pretty cool playing Minecraft in third person, that actually works. This is lagging out for me. 20 seconds to go! Ready to go! So basically you can get a mate. So it's just a general horse. Whee! It's pretty cool. I I'm going to go back in normal person. Normal person. Magnabit. And uh, it's so I can do spells and shit. I'm used to being a fire mage, I don't like. There we go. Yeah, I love playing games with them, especially noobs. Damn it! I died. Ah, died. Ah, died. I died like a lassie. Sorry. This is a respawn point. Yeah, God, I love it, laddie. Damn it. I'm not very good as a frost mage. Doing very little damage right now and I feel a bit stupid.
believe I survived that. I cannot believe I survived that. <laughs> So I'm back on here. We that's a lot of people. Yeah, this is one of the issues with it. Anyone want to want to say hi to you to Right, let's look at broken weapons. So that's what broken weapon looks like. It appears here, and you can get common rare epic legendary. And it costs ten. For saying hi, someone said hi. Oop, I've got a thingy one. No, it's not good. Where actually is it? It's kind of in between. What did that guy say? Isn't it more than say how you say hi YouTube? Lol. Right. So that's it then. Um, if you like the video, click like. If you want more game videos like this, uh, hit the subscribe button. And I hope you enjoy it, really. And um, thanks for watching. Bye. Bye. Bye bye. Hit the like button on the way out.